Flirting and seduction are age-old practices that have been used to attract and captivate potential partners for centuries. Whether you're looking for a casual fling or a long-term relationship, understanding the basics of flirting and seduction can greatly increase your chances of success. By mastering the art of seduction, you can create a powerful connection with someone and leave a lasting impression. In this article, we will explore the fundamentals of flirting and seduction, including body language, confidence, listening, touch, humor, and words, and how to use them to your advantage. The art of seduction. Understanding the basics of flirting. Flirting can be defined as the act of showing interest or attraction to someone in a playful or teasing manner. Seduction, on the other hand, is the process of enticing someone into a romantic or sexual relationship. Both flirting and seduction involve a combination of verbal and nonverbal cues to create attraction and build a connection. Body language plays a crucial role in flirting and seduction. It includes gestures, facial expressions, posture, and eye contact. By using open body language, maintaining eye contact, and mirroring the other person's movements, you can show interest and make them feel comfortable in your presence. Confidence is another key aspect of successful flirting. When you exude confidence, you appear more attractive and desirable to others. It is important to believe in yourself and your worth. Practice self-care, engage in activities that make you feel good about yourself, and surround yourself with positive influences to boost your self-esteem. Listening is an essential skill in flirting. By actively listening to the other person's words and showing genuine interest in what they have to say, you can make them feel valued and understood. Engage in meaningful conversations by asking open-ended questions and providing thoughtful responses. Humor is a powerful tool in flirting as it helps create a positive and enjoyable atmosphere. By making someone laugh, you can establish a connection and make them feel comfortable in your presence. Use lighthearted jokes and witty banter to show your playful side and make the other person feel at ease. The power of body language. How to use it to your advantage. Body language is a universal form of communication that can convey a wide range of emotions and intentions. Understanding the different types of body language and their meanings can help you use them to your advantage in flirting and seduction. Positive body language includes open gestures, maintaining eye contact, leaning in towards the other person, and mirroring their movements. These signals indicate interest, attraction, and engagement. On the other hand, negative body language such as crossed arms, avoiding eye contact, or leaning away from the person can signal disinterest or discomfort. To use body language effectively in flirting, start by maintaining good posture and standing tall. This conveys confidence and attractiveness. Make eye contact with the person you're interested in, but be sure not to stare or make them feel uncomfortable. Lean in slightly towards them to show that you're engaged in the conversation. Mirroring is another powerful technique in flirting. When you mirror someone's movements, such as crossing your legs when they cross theirs or taking a sip of your drink when they do, it creates a sense of connection and rapport. However, be subtle and avoid mimicking their every move as it can come across as insincere or mocking. Confidence is key. How to boost your self-esteem to attract him. Confidence is an attractive quality that can greatly enhance your flirting and seduction skills. When you believe in yourself and project self-assurance, others are naturally drawn to you. Here are some tips on how to boost your self-esteem and project confidence. 1. Practice self-care. Take care of yourself physically, emotionally, and mentally. Engage in activities that make you feel good about yourself, such as exercising, eating well, and pursuing hobbies or interests. 2. Surround yourself with positive influences. Surround yourself with people who uplift and support you. Avoid negative or toxic individuals who bring you down or undermine your self-esteem. 3. Set goals and achieve them. Set realistic goals for yourself and work towards achieving them. Accomplishing your goals will boost your confidence and give you a sense of accomplishment. 4. Challenge negative self-talk. Replace negative thoughts with positive affirmations. Remind yourself of your strengths and accomplishments, and focus on your positive qualities. 5. Step out of your comfort zone. Push yourself to try new things and face your fears. By stepping out of your comfort zone, you will build resilience and confidence in your abilities. By implementing these strategies, you can boost your self-esteem and project confidence, which will make you more attractive to others. The importance of listening, how to show him you're interested. Active listening is a crucial skill in flirting and seduction. It involves fully engaging in the conversation, paying attention to the other person's words, and showing genuine interest in what they have to say. Here are some tips on how to show him you're interested through active listening. 1. Maintain eye contact. Make eye contact with the person you're talking to, as it shows that you're fully present and engaged in the conversation. 2. Avoid distractions. Put away your phone or any other distractions that may take away from the conversation. Give the other person your undivided attention. 3. Ask open-ended questions. 
Encourage the other person to share more about themselves by asking open-ended questions that require more than a simple yes or no answer. 4. Provide thoughtful responses. Show that you're actively listening by providing thoughtful responses to what the other person is saying. Reflect on their words and offer your perspective or insights. 5. Show empathy. Demonstrate empathy by acknowledging and validating the other person's feelings or experiences. This will make them feel understood and appreciated. By actively listening and showing genuine interest in the other person, you can create a deeper connection and make them feel valued. The magic of touch. How to use physical contact to seduce him. Physical contact is a powerful tool in flirting and seduction. It can create a sense of intimacy and attraction between two people. However, it is important to be mindful of personal boundaries and ensure that both parties are comfortable with physical contact. Here are some tips on how to use physical contact effectively. 1. Start with light touches. Begin with light touches on the arm, shoulder, or back. These subtle gestures can convey interest and attraction without being too forward. 2. Pay attention to their response. Observe how the other person responds to your touch. If they lean in or reciprocate the physical contact, it is a positive sign that they are comfortable with it. If they pull away or seem uncomfortable, respect their boundaries. 3. Gradually increase the level of touch. As the interaction progresses and both parties become more comfortable, you can gradually increase the level of touch. This can include holding hands, hugging, or even playful touches like a gentle push or tap on the arm. 4. Be respectful of personal space. Respect the other person's personal space and boundaries. If they seem uncomfortable or express their discomfort, back off and give them space. 5. Be aware of cultural differences. Different cultures have different norms when it comes to physical contact. Be mindful of cultural differences and adjust your behavior accordingly. By using physical contact appropriately and respectfully, you can create a deeper connection and increase attraction between you and the other person. The role of humor. How to make him laugh and win his heart. Humor is a powerful tool in flirting and seduction. It can create a positive and enjoyable atmosphere, make the other person feel at ease, and establish a connection. Here are some tips on how to use humor effectively. 1. Be yourself. Authenticity is key when it comes to humor. Be true to yourself and let your natural sense of humor shine through. Don't try to force jokes or be someone you're not. 2. Use lighthearted jokes. Use lighthearted jokes that are appropriate for the situation. Avoid offensive or inappropriate humor that may offend or alienate the other person. 3. Pay attention to their response. Observe how the other person responds to your jokes. If they laugh and engage in playful banter, it is a positive sign that they appreciate your sense of humor. If they don't seem amused or seem uncomfortable, adjust your approach. 4. Use wit and banter. Engage in witty banter and playful teasing to create a sense of connection and rapport. This can help establish a playful dynamic between you and the other person. 5. Don't take yourself too seriously. Show that you can laugh at yourself and don't take yourself too seriously. This will make you more approachable and relatable. By using humor effectively, you can create a positive and enjoyable atmosphere, make the other person feel comfortable, and increase your chances of winning their heart. The right words. How to choose your words wisely to flirt effectively. Choosing the right words is crucial in flirting and seduction. The words you use can convey interest, attraction, and desire. Here are some tips on how to use language effectively. 1. Compliment sincerely. Offer genuine compliments that highlight the other person's positive qualities or attributes. Be specific and sincere in your compliments. 2. Use playful banter. Engage in playful banter and teasing to create a sense of connection and rapport. This can help establish a playful dynamic between you and the other person. 3. Be confident in your words. Speak with confidence and conviction. Avoid using hesitant or uncertain language, as it can undermine your credibility. 4. Be mindful of your tone. Pay attention to your tone of voice and the way you deliver your words. Use a warm and friendly tone to create a positive and inviting atmosphere. 5. Be respectful. Always be respectful in your language and avoid offensive or derogatory remarks. Treat the other person with kindness and consideration. By choosing your words wisely, you can convey interest, attraction, and desire effectively, and increase your chances of success in flirting and seduction. The do's and don'ts of flirting. What to avoid and what to embrace. In flirting and seduction, there are certain behaviors that are effective and others that are ineffective. Here are some do's and don'ts to keep in mind. Dose. Do maintain eye contact to show interest and engagement. Do use open body language to appear approachable. Do listen actively and show genuine interest in the other person. Do use humor to create a positive and enjoyable atmosphere. Do choose your words wisely to convey interest and attraction. Don'ts. Don't invade personal space or touch without consent. Don't use offensive or inappropriate humor that may offend or alienate the other person. 
Don't nominate the conversation or talk only about yourself. Don't be overly aggressive or pushy in your approach. Don't be insincere or fake in your interactions. By embracing the dose and avoiding the don'ts, you can increase your chances of success in flirting and seduction. The art of teasing. How to keep him interested and intrigued. Teasing is an important aspect of flirting and seduction. It creates a playful dynamic and keeps the other person interested and intrigued. Here are some tips on how to tease effectively. 1. Be playful. Approach teasing with a playful and lighthearted attitude. Avoid being mean-spirited or hurtful in your teasing. 2. Use lighthearted jokes. Use lighthearted jokes or playful banter to tease the other person. Keep it light and fun, and avoid crossing any boundaries. 3. Pay attention to their response. Observe how the other person responds to your teasing. If they engage in playful banter and seem to enjoy it, continue with your teasing. If they seem uncomfortable or offended, adjust your approach. 4. Balance teasing with compliments. While teasing is important, it is also important to balance it with genuine compliments. This shows that you appreciate and value the other person. 5. Be aware of boundaries. Be mindful of the other person's boundaries and avoid crossing any lines. If they express discomfort or ask you to stop, respect their wishes. By teasing effectively, you can create a playful dynamic and keep the other person interested and intrigued. The power of mystery. How to leave him wanting more. Mystery is a powerful tool in flirting and seduction. It creates intrigue and leaves the other person wanting more. Here are some tips on how to create mystery. 1. Don't reveal everything at once. Avoid sharing every detail about yourself right away. Leave some things for later conversations to keep the other person curious. 2. Be elusive. Don't be too available or accessible all the time. Maintain a sense of independence and have your own life outside of the relationship. 3. Keep some things to yourself. Don't share every thought or feeling immediately. Leave some things unsaid to create a sense of mystery and intrigue. 4. Be unpredictable. Surprise the other person with unexpected gestures or actions. This keeps them on their toes and adds an element of excitement to the interaction. 5. Maintain a sense of confidence. Confidence is attractive and mysterious. By projecting confidence, you create an air of mystery around yourself. By creating mystery, you can keep the other person interested and intrigued, and increase their desire to get to know you better. Putting it all together. How to combine these techniques to seduce him successfully. To seduce him successfully, it is important to combine all the techniques discussed above. Here is a summary of how to put it all together. 1. Use positive body language. Maintain open body language, maintain eye contact, and mirror the other person's movements. Two. Project confidence. Boost your self-esteem and project confidence by practicing self-care, surrounding yourself with positive influences, and setting goals. 3. Listen actively. Show genuine interest in the other person by actively listening and engaging in meaningful conversations. 4. Use physical contact appropriately. Use light touches to convey interest and attraction, but be respectful of personal boundaries. 5. Use humor effectively. Use lighthearted jokes and playful banter to create a positive and enjoyable atmosphere. 6. Choose your words wisely. Convey interest and attraction through your words, using compliments and thoughtful responses. 7. Embrace the dose and avoid the don'ts. Follow the dose and avoid the don'ts in flirting and seduction. 8. Tease effectively. Use teasing to create a playful dynamic and keep the other person interested and intrigued. 9. Create mystery. Leave some things unsaid, be unpredictable, and keep the reader guessing. By withholding certain information or leaving loose ends, you can create a sense of intrigue and suspense. Introduce unexpected plot twists or introduce enigmatic characters that keep the reader on their toes. By maintaining an air of mystery, you can captivate your audience and ensure they are eager to uncover the secrets and surprises that lie within your story. Unlock the secrets of love and gain the upper hand in the dating game with Zodiac Compatibility, a woman's guide to dating men using astrology. In the realm of romance, the zodiac holds the key to understanding the complexities of men, making it an invaluable tool for women navigating the dating scene. This comprehensive and witty book provides a roadmap to decoding the enigma of male behavior based on astrological signs. Discover the good and bad traits of each sign, learn the best ways to capture his attention, unravel the mysteries of the first date, and gain insights into the steps to take after that crucial initial encounter. Zodiac Compatibility equips women with the knowledge to approach dating with confidence and strategic finesse. With this guide in hand, you'll be empowered to have any man enchanted and eager to explore the depths of connection. Don't miss the chance to transform your dating experience. Grab your copy of Zodiac Compatibility, a woman's guide to dating men using astrology, today and embark on a journey to mastery in matters of the heart.